I'm Bishop Victoria Hart. Do you know what's going on in the world today? Get ready, you're about to find out. This is The Heart Update, where I keep you in the know. And I'm not going to censor any of it. Today I'm going to talk about spiritual growth. Spiritual growth is the most important thing that you will ever learn. When you're growing spiritually, you're getting more in tune with God. You're getting connected with God. Now, how do we do that? Well, currently we have bishops, archbishops, priests, priestesses, and people who can help you with that spiritual growth. How we do that is we hand down what's called directives from the Lord himself. When we do those directives, we find ourselves growing not only spiritually, but mentally as well. Me and myself, I have gone through many of these. I have had to grow spiritually by doing video presentations, which is something that I never thought I would do. I had to grow in things like figuring out, well, what's this about God and what's this about God but no one ever told me this in church well that's another thing preachers are not going to help you to put it nicely they're they don't know all the information that we know so get in the congregation of Lord Rael that will help you the most another thing that helps you grow spiritually is simply by meditation when you meditate, you get that calm feeling to where you can connect more with God than you would if you were in a busy house or people slamming doors, running around, busy car streets. That's a desk, get somewhere very, very quiet and figure out what works for you. When you're connecting with God, it makes God happy. God likes to talk to you and hear about your day or thank Him for what you're thankful for. Like me, I thank God for our house, for our lives, for our dog, Angel. I thank God for a lot of things in my life. Take, for instance, people that aren't spiritually there they simply want to stay in their comfortable life but they don't want to grow they think God's gonna provide everything for me if I just sit on my booty well I'm sorry that's that's not the case here another thing is if you're in America you are failing the test it's time to get out of Babylon while you still can. A lot of things are happening currently and you need to get out now before it's too late, before they close those borders. Go down to Baja or go to Israel. May God bless you in the name of Lord Rail. I'm Bishop Hart, signing off. Game over.